Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, January 18th, 2023. And here is your reading of the day. So today we're going to be using, like we have been all week, the Elemental Oracle deck for our Oracle card. We're going to be using the Tarot of Oppositions deck as our clarifier today. And we're going to be pulling a mindful message to just help us get started today. So let me get started here. And as I do, I'm going to ask the angels to protect us. I'm going to ask the spirits of the land and my home to surround us. And I'm going to ask the ancestors to give us wisdom. What do we need to know today, Spirit? Please and thank you. All right. So our card today is North Expansion. Wow, look at that. Let me bring it over here a little again. North Expansion. Oh, that's beautiful. I love those colors. Let's pull our tarot card right away before we even talk about expansion. Because that could be many different things. And I want to get what spirit wants me to say right. So let me just shuffle up my tarot of opposition deck here. Shuffles. Okay. We have the Page of Swords reversed, or the Page of Swords in the in the medicine position. You know, often when I when I see the page of swords, the very first thing that kind of pops into my, into my feelings is, um, how do I put this into words? <sighs> Expect the unexpected is basically what I, what I feel when I see this card in the, in the med medicine position that something unexpected might be happening and it may take me off guard a little bit because it's so out of the realm of what I thought might happen, <laughs> but that doesn't necessarily mean bad, does it? Uh, change sometimes is a little hard, and in order for you to experience any kind of expansion in your life, you do have to get comfortable with uncertainty. You do have to get comfortable with facing the unknown. And sometimes our own suffering is caused by the fact that we try so desperately to be in control of everything and everyone around us so that we can predict what will happen next and not have to face the unknown. But then there's no growth. There isn't any growth. There's no expansion in that. So I, I, I really would like to tell you all to just not be afraid of of change, of, of the unknown. Um, because what's coming up around the bend might be the very thing that takes you to the next level in your journey. So don't be afraid. So let's pull a high vibe card, not a high vibe card, a um, mindful message. And it is called Water My Dreams. All I desire is on its way to me, but, like a seed, my dreams, too, must be watered. My belief and determination is what makes them grow. I will be patient throughout this journey. It is all unfolding at a perfect time. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. 
you manifest your dreams by watering them, right? You can't, you can't just stay where you are and control everything and, and hold on to everything super tightly and expect that your dreams are going to grow. There will be no growth if you do that. So let go, let the divine take you into the flow and just go with the flow and let it take you where it's going to take you. My guess is that where you're going next is exactly where you need to be. So thanks for listening today, everybody. I hope you all have a great day. I love you, and I will see you all again tomorrow for another reading. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.